What's up guys, in this short tutorial I will show you how to fix the problem when your mic is not working and other audio issues when playing Black Ops Cold War on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions then leave a comment and let me know. First, open up the game and navigate to your graphic settings. Here, make sure to limit your frame rate to a value above your screen's refresh rate. This can help prevent audio delay caused by using up too many resources to run the game at a higher frame rate. In your audio settings, make sure that your sound is not muted. Set the headphones game sound device to your default device, as well as the headphones voice chat device. After verifying your audio settings, you can close the game. When this is done, right click the sound icon in your taskbar and select open sound settings. On this window, make sure to set the output and input device to your main device. Under Manage Sound Devices, you can select to test or disable your devices. This is essential to troubleshoot any hardware issues. Also, testing your device with another source, such as a video on YouTube, will help you determine where the issue is coming from. In your advanced sound settings, you can assign the input and output devices for each application, as well as changing the volume. After tweaking your settings, you can close this window and search for Device Manager in your taskbar search and hit Enter. On this window, expand the Audio Inputs and Outputs. Here, right-click the output sound device you prefer to use. Select Update Driver and make sure to search automatically for updated driver software. This will take a minute to make sure that your device's driver is up to date. When this is done and the issue persists, then your game files might be corrupted. To fix this, open up your Battle.net launcher and here select Options for Black Ops Cold War and then Scan and Repair. This will take a minute to re-download and replace any missing or corrupted game files. In case you still have audio issues, then your hardware might be faulty. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.